Hello everyone, I am Dr. Shami Mohamed. I am a consultant neurosurgeon practicing at Apollo Hospital, Guwahati. Uh, usually, a uh, tumor when they are small is hard to detect, but once they grow bigger, they might present with their symptoms like a progressive headache, headache associated with early morning, nausea or vomiting, having some focal signs like some weakness in the part of the body or face or deviations or at time they may present the focal seizures. So if this kind of warning sign comes, a patient or a person should come to a doctor for proper evaluation and need to be ruled out brain tumor. But it's not that always brain tumor is present but should be evaluated. Regarding management of brain tumor, uh, once the diagnosis is done, initially they manage some uh, certain medicine like a steroid and the anti-epileptic and then optimize and then confirm the type of the tumor, whether it's really tumor or not, some uh, specific like minimally invasive procedure, what we are doing, the steroidic guided biopsy is required and then confirm and progress further, further multimodal treatment. But at time when the tumor is big enough, need to be decompressed like minimally invasive uh, surgeries, imaging, navigation and microscope or endoscope can be done and based on the biopsy report most of them usually require radiation at time also chemotherapy and the newer immunological treatment also coming up those are the additional things so it's a multimodality treatment in the brain tumor uh, but first thing is the diagnosis and then the early treatment is the best option to control them and give them a better quality of life yeah in last 10 years in Apollo Hospital Guwahati, we have built up a neuro team and the neurosciences uh, specific structures. We have an integrated uh, neurology neurosurgery department, we have a dedicated neuro ISU, we have neuro OT, neuro OPD and the neuro labs are there along with all diagnostic facilities like CT, MRI are available. We have a full project uh, round the clock team from the starting from the emergency department to our neurocritical care team along with backup by the neurological and neurosurgical team of doctors.